Hello everyone, this is Ken Farhid. Today I'll present to you our spectrum analyzer. It's called Canfar Spectrum Analyzer we build. So it's have um, uh, many features like real-time analysis, live signal visualization, and uh, FFT with a professional grade accuracy. And we have a multiple view for waterfall 2D and 3D visualization mode. And it's going to browse this website it's attached in the description below in the video as we can see from here we have a smart device management it's uh it's have a feature the software it's have uh it's a one exe extension for a pc and it's have a feature to running a multiple dungeon the same software you can run two three or four and it's have a support unlimited SL devices attached all together with uh, automatic de detection and management, so it can skip the busy as the autogen, and you can run another one. Uh, the the ready to use told us so you can running uh, actually uh, multiple uh, spectrum analyzer in the same PC in the same uh, page, or if you have uh, different screens. So as you can see from here, we have uh, uh, multiple features here. As we can see, it's one EXE software package. So you have, you can just uh, try to run another one. We have one running actually as the adulting, as you can see from here in this uh, lines view, a 3D lines view. As you can see from here, we have a presets. We have, you can put a frequency step. As we can see, we're running another. As the adorgens, it's this is the, as the adorgens uh, you can use here, and uh, we can just click on start, and we can actually running multiple, so we can get uh, many bandwidth real time at the same time together. So this advantage you can put multiple frequency to monitor, and if you have um, two or three screens, you can actually running like five or six or or eight as the adorgens at the everyone for your specific frequency as we can see from here we we can do a service view we have uh, many views like 2d lines and waterfall and uh, lines of view as we can see you you can pop up a waterfall view and put like here and put another one here uh, every one of these can run on its own frequency so you can specific the, the frequency for every a pop up uh, a view, and you ha we have presets here like for aviation guard or KFOB or NOAA or marine. Let's try to test uh, a remote control. Let's try to test a remote control by clicking in my remote control for garage remote control. As you can see, you can see the spikes going up here. It's uh, it's very good for monitoring. Uh, multi-band frequencies all together at the same time using a uh, cheap tonges hooking together and running just from one exe file as you can see from here we can running two we have uh, uh some presets you can put it your gain you want you can uh, set the frequency let's try to put the um, different frequency like we can like try uh a P25 spikes here, as you can see. So this, uh, our software we build, it's have a, a multiple device, devices uh, simulated operation together and smart busy device handling. So if there's a busy device connected to a different uh, software, so it's uh, skip it and give you the actual uh, uh, gel you can use. As we can see from here, we can browse the, the website. We have another one scrolling RTL sweeper here. Let's try this uh, software. It's uh, it's the same. Uh, it's uh, it's rolling at the same uh, concept of the main software. So. You can run it multiple times. You have uh, multiple frequencies and uh, sweeps connect 
all in the same software so you can put like uh, three uh, dungeons uh, to sweep and one dungeons for a spectrum analyzer all running together uh, at the same function so it's have a multiple device support and automatic uh, detection and real-time FFT spectrum analyzer and you can adjust the frequency range and gain as you can see from here we have a customizable sweep speed and uh, bin size we have a user-friendly interface with the preset span as we can see from here and uh, let's try the 50 megahertz right now as you can see you can uh, the stop frequency static frequency you can adjust you can adjust the speed you can adjust the the nf uh, ft you can the bin size we have our multiple presets you can you can select as you can see from here you can actually running the same software for a different dungeon just double click on the it's exe file so and waiting for a mechanism of detect uh, another ready to use dungeon so it's a skip the busy one as you can see from here we have uh, this dungeon it's ready to use for the software let's try to start it so now we have uh, uh, two sweeps uh, GUI running together all at the same time so every GUI have its own frequency as you can see from here you can put uh, a presets you want you can put for the speed as we as we can see and then just the frequency range again so actually let's try to running the sweeps function and with the spectrum analyzer so what it's going on now so it's uh, the canvas spectrum analyzer software it's launching and uh, detect the the dungeon that use a sweep and skip it and give you the ready one to use this feature is very important so you can handle multiple many dungeons connected at the same software or different software running together all at the time everyone on its own frequency as we can see from here it's detected the dungeon that running in the sweep and the skip it and now it's running we have a sweep from like 30 megahertz here from here in the right and we in the left we we have a, a 90 megahertz uh, monitoring and with 2.4 msps so in the left we have a 2.04 msps and in the right we have a sweep very big gap uh, frequency so you we we can uh, have uh, advanced analysis for uh, many bands all at the same time using uh, cheap dungeons connected together all at the same software we have an additional software it's calling uh, kind of advanced spectrum analysis here we have a uh, advanced signal processing algorithm here we have a multiple visualization mode and uh, real-time uh, frequency analysis and uh, we have uh, a customizable uh, display seating and signal strength monitoring and the frequency band scanning the try to running and we have here a canfar fm radio it's a simple uh, like a terminal uh, uh, gui so you you can uh, you can do uh, uh monitor our uh, or hearing uh narrow band or wide band fm stations and you can uh, put a narrow band you have from 24 megahertz to 1766 megahertz you can catch the commercial FM band and uh, hear it with the simple uh, uh, radio as you can see this picture of it we will run it now we have a high quality audio output of, of 44.1 kilohertz we have a multiple sample rate presets you can uh, put from 250 kilohertz to 2.4 megahertz and uh, now this is uh, here uh, you can uh, decode and uh, resistance and average and smoothing you can adjust all what you want you can here adjust the waterfall uh, you can put the sample rate and center frequency uh, many things you can do and uh, let's try to running this uh, the fourth software it's calling uh, canfar fm radio it's a uh, console based exe extension so all this running on the windows 
it right now in my Windows 11, 64 bit. Now this, uh, you can, uh, the software, you can uh, seek stations actually by, we program it to the right or left by keyboard. It's so easy to seek or change frequencies like uh, from F, F or here are presets, uh, commands how to, to do it or by, by keyboard, like up or down or right or left. And, uh, you, we have a signal sync, uh, real time. We can see, we, as we can see from here, we can save, uh, a box mark station or view and seek station to, or change gain or toggle mode, like wide FM or narrow FM and change the frequency up or down or, uh, Manual frequency on so you can put your frequency manually. It's a nice, uh, uh, small software. You can, uh, uh run it. Uh, it's like a console based, as we can see here, this is a website you can browse and see and download and test, uh, this, uh, for software, as we can see from here. Okay. My friend, this is Kalfar here and, uh, thank you for watching. And we will uh, build uh, many things I will get here in YouTube. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.